for Taps the American Dream, the very end, you say you got your a whole bunch of items, I got my own class four and all that. Is that <coughs> personal items to you that explain like that we all have our own things that make us happy and that we don't really need our money and what we need? Like, what does it mean when you just you got your own and what you explain? It was that song is more than anything supposed to be about like a personal revolution. It's trying to figure out where, you know, your own issues, trying to figure out my own issues. That's a big list of things that, you know, I want to overcome or at least figure out where I fit into. You know, class war being just thinking about overcoming ideas of class and money, and like you said, you know, when it's right down to like 1984, you know, thinking about them. Intrusive big brother. <clears throat> so they're all, you know, they all work like that. We just, me and uh, a couple of my friends were sitting there and we would just bounce back and forth words that rhyme with war. <laughs> picked a big list, you know, had a big list and then picked out the best one. Tried to put them in some kind of order, basically so that I could remember. It's supposed to go from one to the next. It's just so I remember it. You know <laughs>
or to try and branch out or do you like staying locally around here being a smaller I don't know smaller but being uh, as big of a group yeah well we it's bigger than I ever thought it would be and that's still not very big you're okay to say smaller yeah it's definitely smaller but it's a bigger deal than I than I ever thought it would be when I first started even this band. And, especially, and certainly when I started, well, you know, 15 and you're writing songs about girls in the end of the world and, and a band. There's obviously those <clears throat> ideas of I'm gonna be on MTV someday, you know, I'm gonna be, a, I'm gonna pack a stadium, you know. But as, <laughs> as you keep going, it, it starts to feel a little ridiculous, you know. But plus there's a game that you have to play there. Bands that are big are, big because they they play the game you know for the most part and certainly now I think there was a window in there when that wasn't the case but it is a game um, I don't want to be famous or rich or anything off of this all I ever thought about was that I wanted to write some songs and go on tour and have fun and maybe some people will like it you know and they're gonna have a good time with it too I don't know, that's the, the, that's happened, you know. We don't just stay local, we played every state on the East Coast, we've been as far west as Chicago. We play all the time, and I don't remember the last time we played a show that was out of state where there was nobody there that, that didn't come just to see us. And that was really weird in the first place, that people would come and see your band the same way that I'd go and see any band that I liked. So, I guess if I had any aspirations, it would just be more, more of that, you know, more of the same, not a bigger level of it. Just keep doing it how we do it. It feels more honest. It feels more relevant. 